Hello everyone. Now in this video you are going to learn how to draw the projections of a solid cone. As on the screen you can see that draw the projections of a cone of base diameter 40 mm and axis 70 mm long when its axis is parallel to vertical plane and parallel to horizontal plane. So from the question it is known that the solid is the cone and the dimension it is given. So before going to draw once we will have a look what is the cone and what are this one. So here you can see that this is the cone this is the cone having the base diameter this is the base and which is all the generators are connected to a point called this is the apex point. So the cylinder the cone will have only one base is you, you can see that when the observer views from this direction the front view appears as a triangle and the top view appears as a circle. So here you can see this is the cone and having its axis parallel to the vertical plane you can see this is the axis of the cone. So now we are going to draw the same of base diameter 40 mm and axis 70 mm long. The front view will be the triangle and top view is the circle when its axis is parallel to vertical plane. Otherwise when its axis is parallel to vertical plane or it can be termed as the axis is perpendicular to horizontal plane or the base is parallel to horizontal plane or the base is on horizontal plane or the base is resting on horizontal plane. So the similar case but different names will be given like this. So everything if the axis is parallel to VP everything the same. So now we are going to draw the same here. So first we will draw the circle when its axis is parallel to VP the top view will be the circle. So diameter 40 mm right so 20 mm okay. We will project it till the reference plane. This is the axis yeah now the axis is 70 mm long okay. So in the front view you saw that it appears as a triangle. So now I am going to connect this one to the apex point. Yes. Now we connected the generators. It is time to draw the base in the front view. This is the base. So now we will color it. line weight display LWD on ok. Now we will give the notations a cone will have only one base so that is why just I am giving A and then B. The front view is A dash and then B dash. As I said this is the apex point will be denoted with O dash and the same in the top view it will be denoted with O. Yes. This is all about the when the axis is parallel to vertical plane and now you can see that when the axis is parallel to horizontal plane. You can see this is the same cone but the axis is parallel to horizontal plane. Now the axis is parallel to horizontal plane. So now when the axis is parallel to horizontal plane the front view appears as a circle top view appears as a triangle. You can see the axis is parallel to horizontal plane or perpendicular to vertical plane or the base the base is parallel to vertical plane or the base is on vertical plane or base is resting on vertical plane. So this is the one. Now we will draw the front view as a circle and top view as a triangle in this condition. 
साकिल ट्वेंटी यस will go for the axis axis is 70 mm long now connect this this is the base Yeah. Now here we'll give the notations. So here A dash front view and B dash, and this apex point is O dash. Whereas in the top view A B. This is O. So now we completed the views. It's time to queue the line types. As you you know that the axis is represented with the long dash, short dash, long dash, short dash line. So here it's a continuous line. Both the axes are are a continuous line. Now to queue this one type. other load so i prefer center to line center to okay now just i am applying the line type as center to see you can see this is the axis line suppose if you want to reduce i mean we want to make it perfect still perfect type the lts means line type scale as of now autocad default it gives line type scale as 1 now i am going to make it as 0.5 see now very detailedly you draw on the axis so i change the line type scale as 0.5 now these are the projections of a cone base diameter 40 mm and axis 70 mm long now we will give the dimension we'll take the linear so this is the axis we can increase the text 5 current close you yeah, see the axis is 70 mm long and the same will give here also dim linear always place the dimension outside of the projection don't place inside here now we'll give the diameter of the base diameter of the base yes so these are the projections of a cone when its axis parallel to vertical plane and parallel to horizontal plane you can see in the layout perfectly it fits